In Brazil, right-wing presidential frontrunner Jair Bolsonaro is leading handily in the polls ahead of his weekend's election, as civil society groups are warning against a dangerous turn toward authoritarian rule. Reporters Without Borders is warning against ongoing attacks on press freedom, including threats against reporter Patricia Campos Mello, who wrote the widely circulated story claiming pro-Bolsonaro business leaders are funding an online smear campaign against his opponent, Fernando Haddadji. Meanwhile, video has surfaced of Jair Bolsonaro's son, Eduardo, threatening to shut down the Supreme Court if his father doesn't win the upcoming elections. And former Brazilian political prisoners are calling out Bolsonaro's frequent praise for Brazil's former military dictatorship and his defense of notorious torture chief Carlos Alberto Briante Ostra, who died without ever being tried for his crimes. This is former political prisoner Gilberto Natalini. Então, eu acho que quem defende o Ustra, o próprio Bolsonaro, o Bolsonaro sabe quem foi o Ustra, né? Ele sabe. Ele tem uma vertente autoritária e uma vertente, na minha opinião, ele, ele tange o bestial no momento em que ele defende a tortura. Ele sabe, ele não é um inocente útil, tá certo? Agora, é, muita, muita gente do povo brasileiro está votando nele, está apoiando ele por reação contra a quadrilha do PT. Então nós ficamos entre uma coisa ruim e uma coisa pior.